Hello everyone, and welcome back to Fred Video Games, and back to January for Julius. Before we get into today's video, I would just like to say, I've been on YouTube for a full, over a full year now, and I would like to say thank you for everyone who has supported my content over the last year, and made this channel grow. I appreciate all the support that you guys have given, and will give to me in the future as I continue to create more content for you guys. With that said, let's get into... Five facts about Julius Belmont. Fact one about Julius Belmont. He's the only Belmont to have a fight with Dracula that has yet to been made into a video game. And judging by the state of Konami at this point, I don't think that he will ever have a video game made about him. Fun fact two about Julius Belmont. He was born in the year 1980, which puts him at 55 years during the events of Area of Sorrows and then 56 years during the events of Dawn of Sorrows. Which also makes him the person with the highest age to ever use the Vampire Killer Whip. Unlike the other Belmonts that used a plethora of different sub-weapons, Julius only felt he should have utilized the basics and mastered them instead of having a wide variety of items that he used okay. This is why he only has three sub-weapons and one item crash in the games he is playable in. Richter Belmont gave away the Vampire Killer Whip, deciding that he would not curse his children to have the same fate and dread of one day having to fight Dracula like he did. Julius Belmont was actually the first Belmont to retake this up after Richter decided it should no longer become a family tradition. Lastly, less of a fact about Julius Belmont, but rather a theory. A lot of people have pointed out that there seems to be a lot of similarities between the artwork of Julius Belmont in Arian Sorrows and Koji Igarashi, both their western style and facial features seem to be quite the same. I have two images up on them on the screens and I want you guys in the comment section down below to see if Julius Belmont is really inspired by this man. I hope you guys enjoyed five fun facts about Julius Belmont. See you next Friday night at 5 o'clock for January for Julius.